I'm not entirely sure what this means. Like, does it just... Uh, why did I do that? Hello guys, how are you all doing today? Now, in case you guys didn't remember, in the last episode I said, in this episode we'd be working on getting some good power set up, because quite frankly, this place doesn't have enough power to power the furnace, and the soil centrifuge, the printer, the big printer, and even the research chamber, which I plan to have maybe three of them in the future. So we're going to work on getting our power set up, and also in case you guys didn't know, I will be doing a stream at 2pm today, uh, which is Wednesday, June 24th, as the automation update comes out today. Now in case you're wondering, currently it is 9am for me at the time of this recording, so 2pm is far away from me, and it's also Mountain Daylight Time, so if you guys want to know what it is your time, uh, just do Mountain Daylight Time, 2pm, and convert to whatever you are, whether that's Australian or whatever. Anyways, I guess we should start getting started on the power, so let's take a look at what we have for options here. So, I believe we have batteries somewhere here. Anyways, medium solar panels cost... Copper and glass. I did not know they cost glass now. But we also have batteries that we need, which requires zinc and lithium. Oh boy, so glass is made probably from sand, I'm not sure. We also have medium generators, we could also use this and have to get carbon. I kind of want to go medium solar panels as well as batteries, but that is 3750 bytes. So, I'll probably do a lot of off-camera work to try and get these bytes, but other than that, uh, I guess we'll go with solar panels, platforms, and medium batteries. So, that's a total of 8,000... 7, 7, bytes, I believe? 7,500 bytes, yeah. That is a lot of bytes. Um, zinc and lithium. What do we need to make glass, is my curious question. How do you make glass? Because I really don't know how. Okay, so glass is actually made on the furnace from smelting quartz. Now, here's the funny thing. I believe this can actually do quartz. Yes, it can. All we need to do is fill up a bit of our dirt. This on the soil centrifuge, which I fill up halfway now, and we're also going to do two quartz. So, let's see. Yeah, power is really not having it right now. Alright okay, guys, I am back. So, as it turns out, sphalerite is zinc. Sphalerite? Sphalerite? I don't know how you say it, sphalerite. But if that's zinc and you smelled it, so we're going to go get some sphalerite. And lithium is going to be a bit more of a hassle. Now, lithium does not occur naturally on this planet. So to get lithium, we have to find it in some of those underground pods, which luckily, there is a whole bunch underground. Okay, and we are back, my dear, dear friends. Turns out, this was not quartz. In the last episode, you may have seen me say this is quartz. Well, it turns out I was wrong. This is not quartz. We actually found some power cells, too. But, not quartz. It's, uh... Salarate, so good to know. We're gonna mine some of this and we'll take it up. And yeah, uh, I'm gonna have to clean up my inventory a bit. Alright, okay, guys, we're now above ground, so we are actually going to be doing a rocket ship research. Because lithium, we can't find it anywhere, can't really find it naturally, so sucks. So we are going to be doing a rocket ship. A small shuttle, 1,500 bytes. We don't have enough. But I do have quite a bit of uh, research samples, so we're going to throw these on. And yeah, we'll be back when this is all through. I'll actually probably shove this one on too now that I think of it. And yeah. We will be back later, guys. And we also have a new platform over here. 
so we shall do that. Anyways, guys. Um. Yep, we'll be back, I guess, when we can do research. Okay, guys, we are back. The research just finished, and we now have 3,214 bytes. We got the small shuttle, so I guess now we will make it and see what it requires as well. I hope it doesn't need too much. Ooh, press platform. I mean, trading platforms, they're expensive actually. So, hopefully we don't need a thruster, but we will see. So we're gonna get our large printer. And a small shuttle takes two aluminum, so not bad actually. Let's actually grab some of that. We actually have a couple of aluminum over here, I believe. Yes, we do. So we actually put this on and let's make the small shuttle. Guys, it is almost done, I believe. I think it's just a little antenna now. And there we go. Hot dang, guys, we now have a spacecraft. Now, does it need a thruster? Does it need, like, a fuel? What happens if I press C? It needs thruster, that's the oxygenator. So we need a thruster and an oxygenator, it seems like, so... Let's find where the thruster is. Oxygenator, 1,800. And we are back, guys, so... We got a few research now. Now, I believe we can do the thruster. We already have the thruster. What did we want? Oh, oxygen here. 1,800. Oh, we are so close. Uh, what happens if I try and research a copper? How much would that give us? 75. I think that's enough. Yep. Alright. Uh, I guess we'll be back when the, this piece of copper is done. Oh okay, yeah, so this is going to be far from done, but at least we now have 1,800, so let's get the Oxygenator. Takes aluminum ceramic. Gosh dang it. I think ceramic is clay, so it should be pretty easy. Uh, then the thruster... Ammonium and aluminum. So ammonium isn't that hard, aluminum isn't that hard. Except for the fact that I don't know where the aluminum deposit is, I completely forgot where it was. Anyways, we actually do have the copper and the glass, so let's make two solar panels. Medium solar... Ah, yes, quality. And now, guys, we have our two solar panels, so... Let's put them... Over here, and see what happens. So we're actually gonna put these right here and here. Hold F and hold F. I actually don't need these currently. Ah, so guys, here we are. We've got our oxygenator in here, and we also have our rocket here. Now, solid fuel, good for a round trip. I'm not entirely sure what this means. Like, does it just... Uh, why did I do that? Uh, we'll, we'll be back when I get another. Do that. Anyways, guys, we are going to launch and see where we can go. Now, we are landing in a crater. Doesn't look too deadly. Oh, the thrusters there, sweet. Okay, so I did not bring compound. And here we are, guys. Lithium, which is insanely far from the ship. Ah, uh, yeah, I burned through most of my tethers. I have like two left, I had three bundles, so. Anyways, let's see how much lithium is actually here, and we're gonna try and get as much as we can. I don't want organic. Uh, the generator, I guess I don't need. This stuff is extremely hard to get, so I'm going to get as much as I can. 
So yeah, it's this weird yellow, purple, golden type material, it seems. It's pretty sweet. I'm gonna try and grab as much as I can while I am here. Which means I may have to ditch some of the stuff on my inventory because it's just not as important. Tethers, we don't need them. Um, graphite, we don't need it. Ammonium, that stuff is everywhere. Resin, batteries, I kind of want the batteries, but I mean... Priorities. This stuff stores a ton of power, so... Ah, there. We're gonna get what we can. So, there's a lot of lithium here. I might not actually be able to grab all of it. Ah, tethers. Small battery? Eh. Let's try to can... No. Uh, small printer. We can always make another. And we can get one more. It's right here though, so... Oh boy. Oh, I'm gonna die, aren't I? Alright, well here we are. We're gonna get back on the ship. I wanted to take the research back, but I was unable to. So... From the way here, I did land on a, the wrong... I went to the wrong planet, I guess you could say, so... I'm gonna hope I can make it back nicely. So we're just gonna press V, and we need to find our planet. And guys, look at that! We have now landed on the pad, so... <sighs> we can exit, and if we want, we can probably make some batteries now. Except for the fact that I think... Where were batteries made? You guys, we're back with the small printer, right there again. And now we have a few zinc. So let's get the zinc. Ah, I guess that's it. Okay, we shall now start printing a few batteries. Ah, so... Yep, I'll be done when I have all these batteries made, and maybe a few platforms as well because we, we need them. <laughs> and now guys, we have a few platforms. And now the process of hooking all of these up. This is going to be our battery and solar panel array, I guess is what I'm going to call it. But actually, this is kind of cool, I think. So we're just going to do that. And there we go. Power. And I'm just going to... Do this to help solve some of my problems. There we go. Now, we actually have a few batteries we can still probably make. And there we have it guys, now we have a whole bunch of batteries. Oh boy. And the last one we obviously can't even pick up, so all these batteries are now going to go on storage, and who oh boy. Let's see what we get. So, got a ton of batteries. I am glad I picked up this much lithium. Don't think I could have done it without it. We could do this. Oh boy. That. And that. As well as we're going to move the solar panels to here. And this one to here. And there we have it guys, we now have a ton of battery storage. So this should keep our base running all of the night, hopefully. Huh. Yeah, that's, that's a lot of progress for sure, I'd say. Oh, research. So anyways guys, I hope you guys all had a fantastic day. This has been a longer episode. This has taken way too many hours to make and gather resources. So we went from basically all this to basically all that, as well as we got ourselves a shuttle because we had to get lithium, which I believe the booster will still work, actually, it looks like. That's pretty amazing. So I could probably do one more trip for lithium and then that'll be done, or I'll land on that planet and that will be it, so I won't be able to get back. 
Yeah, and also, this is Clay right here, in case you guys were wondering. Anyways, I hope you guys look forward to the stream, because I will be streaming at 2 p.m. later today, if the thunderstorm doesn't kick out my power, because we're about to get a storm here, but I'm praying that it doesn't kick out my power. Anyways, guys, have a fantastic day, and I'll see you next time on Astroneer.